Well, hello there, how's doing it again? In one of the videos I showed you there, we took a look at uh, uh, Ricky Baker's Way of the Dragon books and I compared them to Steve Carriage ones and Steve Carriage ones are a lot better, I'm sorry, but the Ricky Baker ones are excellent but Steve's are just a lot better. Now we're going to take a look at Fist of Fury. Now, as everybody knows, Steve Carey's on that classy book, Intercepting Fist, and it was mostly consistent of Fist of Fury, and it is absolutely spot on. The hardback version, which I've got, is a must-have for any Bruce Lee fan. But, if you can't get a hold of that one, there is a softback version as well, you can pick that up, but if you want cheaper books, Ricky's books are okay. Uh, paper quality is not the best. It's not the greatest. But it's packed with, they're packed with some great photos from my favourite Bruce Lee movie. That's Bruce vs. Uh, Bob Baker. Absolutely. I think that's a brilliant fight. Vastly underrated. It's a great battle. But uh, if you get a chance to pick it up, go for it. If you're a big fan of Fist of Fury like myself, it's a must have. Now you've done uh, Chinese Connection, Fist of Fury Volumes 1 and 2. So here's Volume 1. Probably with some, some same type of photos, but you got a lot of like, these collectibles in here. Posters, lobby cards. Very, very cool. Magazines, books, videos. There you go. Absolutely spot on. And some cool collectors put their stuff in here as well. Some great shots. As everybody knows, I'm a massive fan of that movie. And now, this is volume two. Some good behind the scenes stuff here. And some really cool picks. Do I think the books are worth the money? Eh, uh, you get what you pay for. You actually get what you pay for. And I would, I would pick them up. Uh, well, I have picked them up, but uh, I'd recommend getting them. But as I say, uh, paper-wise, not the greatest, but still very, very cool. Well, thank you for watching another wee dark video of yours truly. And if you fancy the books, go to eBay or go to Ricky's page on Facebook and pick them up. Bye for now.